Yo, what's going on, sexy Sella? It's got today. We're here doing a ranked one v one, and we're playing Zongkui. Why are we playing Zongkui? Because of the revert, or the change, or the buff, or the new news, or whatever you want to call it. But we're playing Zonger because of the passive. He got his passive back. Previously, they they basically removed his passive. Um. So before before the change, the, before this patch. His protections were 0.5 instead of 1, and max stack of 60 instead of 40. So overall, it took a lot longer to stack, and you got 30 protections. But with this one, with this Zongkui, it's very quick to stack. It takes like 5 waves or something, if you're doing camps as well. Um, and you get 40 protections, so you get 10 more protections at a quicker pace overall. So it's very good. It's a very good change. And um, I'm hoping... I'm hoping that... Uh, it doesn't become super rampant in all modes again. But I'm pretty sure he will. Because it's a pretty strong change, man. It's a really crazy change. <laughs> nice. I face tanked that because it's important. To not let him get free wave clear over me. I don't want to just hold L's when I don't absolutely need to. That's going to do some nice numbies. Nice trades, nice trades. He's got a lot of health pots. I don't really care if he clears now because I'm already at the waves, so... No need to face tank those. Nice damage. That'll do about 120. Because it does 5 ticks. 20 each. Technically 130 because it does 22 each. I do more damage per auto than him. Assuming I hit both. Alright. I hit 5 here. He hits 5 here. Um... Hmm. That's a lot of damage. He's gonna have to back here. Stopping his back there is pretty big. Good clear, good clear. Let's see if maybe... I'll pop my pot so I can stay a bit longer. See if we can do this red buff. It's going to be difficult. And arguably not possible. Nice. Very good. Very, very good. He got tier 2 boots, so he's not that much stronger than me right now. Oh, good Aegis. Good Aegis. Not bad at all. But honestly, that's really good for me because I got the red buff. Like, I got the XP and the gold advantage. And we got his relic. So now when my ult is up, he's going to ult me. But I'm going to be able to Aegis and just stand in his ult. Because I don't think my ult gets slowed down, actually. I think it still does the same amount of damage. I think everything does the same amount of damage. Two HP, you're trolling. So yeah, that's a, this is a pretty good scenario so far, and you can really feel the difference, right? Like because of this change, because of the change they gave him on his passive, you can honestly feel like, like you don't need to build defense that quickly, because you just have inherent tankiness as a character. That thank God should be inherently fucking tanky, you know, like, <laughs> it's very nice, it's very nice, good clear, good clear, we're just chilling, probably going to his blue, ooh, he could have stolen that over the wall with that too, but he's just clearing waves, alright, why didn't he go for his blue or anything? Unless his blue's already down. Who can 
we catch tonight? I am far in. Kind of shitty. The situation. I might be able to kill him here, though. Ah, I missed that. No kill potential anymore. I just ran back the other way, I guess. Uh. This outruns me when he ults. That's really lame. If that's his game plan this entire game, that's that's pretty fucking lame, dude. I'm I'm more than likely not going to enjoy this game if that's his entire game plan. I don't think that I can ever win this fight here, unfortunately. I got no mana. I got no mana. No mana. Oh my gosh. My boy is just out autoing the fuck out of me. He also hits a lot harder per auto. I think, right now. But I heal more, so that's cool. If that hit, we killed him, dude. If that hit, we guaranteed the kill on him. Look for the ones who are wandering alone. Uh, he's got health pots. I can't do anything to him, man. I'm just going for the minis right now. He's got his whole fucking... Arsenal of abilities. Abilities. Jesus. Jesus. I think a gem of ISO is going to be gigantic here. I like actually fucking game changing. Let's go for the wave first. My two should clear, right? Nice, okay. Get the blue buff. I probably don't want to go Telekines this game. Just because of the fact that, like... Um... He autos more than me. <laughs> Uh, we're really even. He just hit level 12 with this wave. I'm going to hit level 12 with this wave. So. Even game, even game. He got a demonic. Weird he wouldn't go lifesteal there, honestly. In my opinion, lifesteal would be much better. Uh, very close to killing. Very close. Nice. Ow. Oh. <laughs> the tower, dude. He altered me under tower. I was just getting dicked on the entire time. What the fuck? Who can we catch Drop a ward there. Get this <coughs> minion wave. Perfect. Perfect. Pretty good gameplay so far. It's really, really good for me that he went... Um, by the way, I'm going... Sprint, I think. It's very good for me that he went not lifesteal right here. Because if he went lifesteal right here instead of going demonic, then my, my itemization would be really bad for him. But thankfully, it's not that bad. I should have done this. That was stupid to just run past it. But, you know, is what it is, I suppose. I definitely suppose.
Damn it. And being bad is so not fun. Man. Okay. This is running, man. Um, I think I'm just gonna commit and use my face to tank. Yeah, I mean, I lost a lot of HP to do it, but I think overall, it's fine. NBD. This blue comes up very shortly. It's actually backing. Okay. Weird time to back when you know your buff is coming up, but I will absolutely accept it. Next item is going to be Divine. Like I said, I don't need defense immediately um, because of my passive gives me so much defense. You know, I'm at 84 right now. He's got a tier 3 item and he's only 40 ahead, so it's, um, it's pretty good for me. And when I ult anyways, I get double the protection, so it's even better. Even better. So I'm just going to farm up till a divine and then I'll back and get it. Honestly, I should be able to get it after this wave, I think. He doesn't really do that much damage, so. I'm cool with just boxing. Cool with tussling. Oh, oh. Alright, let's go get our divine. Who's eager to die? And then, I guess we go Pestilence now. Nice, two autos kills that now. I don't need to waste time on that third. No thank you, Mr. Ugly. Ah oh, damn it dude, he's so fast. He just like autos and then fucking turns around and runs away. It's so annoying, holy shit. He's so fast, too. Goddamn annoying boy. That's what I'm gonna call him. Just annoying boy. Alright, he ran the other way, so we'll get some good tower damage here. 500? 600? Oh, 600 tower damage, not bad. We got the divine on him, so his three's not doing too much. I'm gonna clear a wave. Actually didn't decide to back. Which is fine by me again. I don't really care. The crit chance is starting to get really fucking annoying though, I'll admit. Okay. Hit me with one auto and it crit me. Annoying. Oh, close. Close. This is a good, good Aegis, good Aegis. Nice play. Unfortunately for him, it doesn't really matter because I am Zong Kuei and I have a lot of lifesteal, so. My one with my build should definitely clear wave, so I don't need to stay. <coughs> and now we start our Pestilence. So yeah, with... <clears throat> with what you just saw, that's pretty much my game plan. He ults me, I just Aegis and sit in his ult. And then by the time my Aegis runs out, his ult is almost done. And I'm ready to uh, to stun and get some heavy damage off. That's pretty much the game plan. Once we get a Pestilence, we'll be in a pretty good spot. Probably should have used my 2. I feel like my 1 is more valuable right now. Because he's so poke heavy. Just 
throwing autos at me whenever he gets the chance. Did he get more defense? No. I really thought he was closer than that. God damn it, dude. Ugh, annoying, 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 annoying. Oh, nice. Actually hit him with that one. Okay. He did the right play running that way. He knows I can't do anything if he uh, if he just runs away. So. It is mine. Mine. You're next. Nice. Got the slow on him there. Honestly, that's pretty good. Getting his beads there is actually really good. Nice. Drive by two. Throw an auto in there as well. That way we get some tower damage with the minions and we get the red buff. <clears throat> See, he's going Toxic Blade right now. Alright. I am relying on healing a bit. I missed. I missed the big ones. Damn. I really wanted the kill there, but... I don't got the stuff. I don't got the stuff yet. Let's go ahead and back. Get that pestilence. God, that's really annoying. Honestly, I think I will go Toxic Blade, actually. He's probably going to take my tower here. Yeah. No point in running over there to defend it. He's fucking Oleron, so... My tower dies whenever he wants it to die, pretty much. <clears throat> this guy plays really, really annoying, I'll be honest. This guy autos and then runs, autos and then runs. But, I mean, it's what he ha- I know it's what he has to do. Like, I'm not bashing him. I'm just saying, like... With his playstyle against the god I'm currently playing, um, it seems like I have no chance. And he's so fucking fast, too. Oh my gosh. I have Gem of Iso, man. Mm. Well, that actually, like, did nothing, almost. Why do I feel like I did better without my ult than I did with my ult? Okay, he's out there healing as well. I'm over here healing, he's over there healing. Got a little pokey poke on him there. Backed. Okay. Red buff is mine then. I think I just go back right now. He probably goes straight to Bull Demon. Oh, he didn't. That's a mistake. 
He should have gone straight for Bull Demon 100% of the time there. He's going Telekines now, I think. Which is definitely the play. I don't hear him doing Bull Demon. That was uh, a whole lot of damage. It is mine. Mine. Okay. Alright. Uh, we got... <coughs> his alt. It's fine. I still have my important relic for when we fight. My ages. Mm. Really don't do that much damage to him. It seems like he's relying on his healing a lot as well though, honestly. So all my anti-heal is pretty strong. <clears throat> I'm kinda low on the manners. <clears throat> I think this winning this game definitely requires uh, selling of boots and then another attack speed item, I think. So I'm buying a 1500 pot preemptively. Alright, uh, buff just spawned. I'm over here doing fucking blue. Alright. Okay. Not bad, honestly, not a bad fight for me. You sure you want to do this, brother? Oh, I don't know if you want to do this anymore. That was a little bit greedy, my boy. That was a little bit greedy. I cannot do Bull Demon that quickly because I don't have that much damage. I mean, I say I don't have that much damage. I do have a lot of damage, but he's just really tanky because of the whole healing aspect. But I think it doesn't matter because with 1.29 attack speed and the fact that I'm Zonkwe and I have double autos, I can just take the Phoenix this way. I don't need to do Bull Demon. So it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Got his telekines. Your chosen one. Give me your soul. Oh, he backed. He actually just backed there. That's weird. I would not have done that. Okay, so I'm selling boots for chrono spending because I think the cooldown is actually huge. I initially. I initially was thinking to sell that for some attack speed, like a Telekines myself. Um, but I actually think that if I just get cooldown, it's enough. 
I really do think that. Okay. Holy fuck. Ow. Um, you're not gonna back? You're really not backing, dude? Come on. Don't be like that. There we go, okay. Okay, there it is. I was gonna say, like, not backing is... He already, he literally died late game and lost Phoenix because he was greedy. If he didn't back there, that's like the most ultimate greed play you can do. Uh, he ran. Hmm. That is not good. My full combo did not kill him. Maybe I was not weaving in the autos enough. Maybe I go for a full one shot and I just completely like give up on cooldown. That's a possibility. I feel like cooldown doesn't help me that much because I can only get one rotation off anyways. That's what I feel like at least. God, I'm actually dead. Oh, no, I'm not. I just back right now. I back right meow and I'm good. <clears throat> I could have been dead. If he placed that alt better, I was actually 100% dead there. This is a really tough game, actually. Because he's just throwing autos out at max range and I can't even get close. Gem of Iso is absolutely necessary. If I land a 1, it, let, it lets me get close. So I would say that's 100% necessary. Mm. But god damn, he heals a lot. And he autos so fast. 2.36. 2.5 with his two active. Okay, that actually crit the fuck out of me, which is not cool at all. Just wanted to use the two immediately. That I got all the healing that I needed. <clears throat> oh my god. So he actually broke... He breaks attack speed cap when he's sitting in his ult. And even though I Aegis, it didn't matter. Oh, I sh you know what I should have done? First off, he did three... Or Wait, what? Why does this say 2886 or 2868? This is 2278. I don't know. I don't know, man. Like, it feels like there's nothing I can do, you know? It just doesn't matter what I do because I'm fucking dead regardless. I guess I lose here no matter what. I don't know, I mean, the playstyle itself is just kind of a counter, huh?
He definitely could have ended, by the way. He still might try. Back, okay. I sold my cooldown for Rod. I'm hoping it has some sort of effect. At least some sort of the effect that I want it to have. He probably could have just backdoored. It's kind of like nice of him not to. Oh, I think he's just gonna run. Damn, he's full fucking health again. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus Christ, dude. He literally doesn't even have to play the game, he just holds left click. By the way, Shadow Walker literally only plays Oleron. I've I fought him about 12 to 15 times this split. Every single game he plays all around. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, guys. Peace. God fucking damn it.